precisely my dream place would be like where I am right now. Just no, no change. <laughs> if you were to have a child, what would you name it? I never think about this too much because I'm not a big child person, but I used to think of things like when I was in middle school, and I always tried to be really unique. I know I had a name list back then, and I know for a fact one of them was Dior for a girl. so unique and like luxurious and I always liked Conan. I got that from Conan Gray. But like, would I actually want to name my kid that? I don't know. Like, I, I don't n know if there's any names that are like I'm in love with, but there are names that I think are very cool. So, I don't have like, so those are my two names that I know I used to have on the list. Um, I just know I loved Dior like that specifically. I don't know why. <laughs> so, next person. I don't know if I should be like saying names. I'm going to at least say names if they're channel names because why not? So, rudimentary ASMR asked, what Harry Potter house do you think you would get sorted into? So, I've never read or watched anything Harry Potter. I've never, like, gotten into that stuff. But, I don't want this to be a complete disappoint disappointment of a question, because you obviously are interested in that. So, I took a quiz right before this video. A random internet quiz. And it told me, Hufflepuff. Um, in a Crazy Ex-Girlfriend, they do talk about Harry Potter stuff. So, like, that's my most knowledge, is that they said what they were in the show. But I don't know anything, but the quiz says Hufflepuff. So, do with that information what you will. <laughs> Your favorite shape of pasta. I think penne. Not only because I said I like penne vodka, but I think it's the most convenient are kind of fun too. I hate any kind of spaghetti, like even the fettuccine. Um, like, I don't necessarily think that's fun to eat, but it tastes good. Like, that's too much work to twirl it, and like, it's a mess. So, definitely something that's like either penne, like bow ties are fun, but I don't think they taste the best. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna go with penne. But I know I kinda like bow ties. I used to like elbows when I was a little kid. But I don't eat those anymore. But maybe elbows do. <laughs> um, would you rather hear bagpipes every time you closed your eyes to go to sleep or never be able to eat food again? This is a really good question because kind of sad. I've only started for the past like couple months. I've actually started eating an apple almost every night. I put like honey, granola, hemp, hearts, um, cinnamon, and peanut butter powder, and a couple of white chocolate chips. I might like cut up an apple and put all that stuff on it. It's really good. Highly recommend. Um, so that would be sad, but also there's other foods. There's so many foods in the world, but you can't replace sleep. So I'm going to have to say never eat fruit again. I, I'm not like a big, like I don't eat strawberries. I don't eat like, wa I don't know if watermelons, I think it's a fruit, but like I don't like any of that stuff. So like. I know there's people that love, like, watermelon and, like, like, in the summer, I know that's a big food that all my friends would eat, and I'd be like, no, I don't want any. So, I'm gonna have to say that's almost an easy question for me if I didn't start eating apples a ton, but, yeah, definitely still gonna 
is all my questions. Um, if you did have anything and didn't see any kind of like post, if you would like to comment.